Hey folks, just want to take a few minutes to demo the features of this really superb Ariston Audio RD11S with a Grace 704 tone arm. I purchased this from the estate of an autophile who was the original owner. This was purchased new in 1977. Just to give you an idea of the quality, um, this sat roughly between your, your Thorns, your TD145 available at that time and your Lynn Sondek. So Thorns was a little bit less, the Lynn was a little bit more, but, but that's, that's really the quality and performance. Um, and essentially the, also the design DNA that you're, you're, you're looking at here. So a, a few things about the table. So it's a suspended chassis design, uh, similar to those other tables. So the um, ladder and uh, tone arm are on a chassis that's suspended below and that's been dialed in for uh, this setup. Uh, it has a synchronous uh, motor, so a uh, very high quality motor, so your speed stability is very good, coupled with an 11 pound uh, two-piece platter. So with a bell drive you really you really want a heavy platter and uh, tables of this quality have, have a platter like that. Um, and uh, beyond that a very high quality bearing. So those those are the basics for a very high quality manual turntable. Uh, another thing to note is that the, the plinth is, is solid teak, so uh, it's not a veneer, and this is the original condition. Um, this thing uh, is truly superb, uh, both the table and the tone arm. I mean, practically museum quality, just, just really amazing. Um, to talk a little bit about then the tone arm, this, this unit was available without a tone arm, um, and the most common option was the SME uh, 3009. Um, that's, that's proven to be a very popular tone arm, so uh, people very, very commonly um, uh, strip them off to, uh, to sell them separately. The upgrade option for this table was the, the Grace 704. So this is the tone arm originally fitted to this table. Uh, like I said, it was the upgrade, upgrade option, and uh, features a uni pivot design, uh, which is really wonderful design, uh, very much audiophile uh, quality, but does, does take a little bit more time to, uh, to set up and, and uh, get tweaked and dialed in. Uh, but once you do, it's, it's wonderful performance and, and, uh, and very stable. Uh, let's, uh, let's do a, just a very quick demo. The table has one, con one control an on switch and the platter comes up to speed um, you know it's heavy platter so it takes a couple seconds but uh, no big deal um, actually it was already queued up so let's move it over and let it come down so not really looking to demo the music quality here because uh, we're you know we're with my camera speakers it's uh, not really going to convey it uh, but the quality sound quality is is really really quite superb I have an Audio Technica 3600L cartridge mounted which is a very well regarded uh, entry-level cartridge really to uh, to get you going um, Many people will want to uh, to upgrade. You really can't put too nice of a cartridge on this you know this level of setup. And you know you can obviously see what see what it looks like. It's a great um, piece, really fantastic mid-century uh, design uh, combination of uh, kind of conservative looks with the plinth and uh, a very very streamlined and uh, aerodynamic looking um, uh, tone arm. So. It, it, it's beautiful looking, it's a, it's a great performer, and uh, it really should bring uh, anybody, especially uh, someone looking for audiophile, manual, uh, belt drive turntable, really years of enjoyment. So thanks for watching.